Hello everybody, we're back here with some more franchise, and as you can see, I'm sucking hard right now, but that's because I had Mr. Walk relieving me in that last game, and I got beat in extra innings. Because Ball 4 wanted to lose me the game, which was pointed out in the comment section, and I thought, boy, you're right, hey, get rid of this dude. So I went ahead and did a couple of trades here, and I'll show you them real quick. So I went ahead and got, uh, I don't know how to say his name, Danny Foku, Fokuhar or something? Not sure. Uh, and then I got Wade Davis, and I got Charlie Furbush. So hopefully my relievers will be a little bit better than what I was enduring. So, alright, let's get on to this next game. Garrett Cole. Alright, here we go. 0-2. Freaking fantastic. God dang start. Am I right? Alright. Let's go. I need to get my hitting going. Look how poor my hitting is. Look at that. Manny Machado has nothing. And Rosny Castillo has nothing. Oh my goodness. Doing horrible at my hitting. God dang it. God dang it. Ah. Uh, dang it. Ugh. Horrendous hitting. James Loney has my best hitting average. No. We've got baseball from New Yankee Stadium. All right, let's try to do something this time. Next. All right, here we go. Garrett Cole. Let's see how we do. I was all, after all my pitches have pitchers have pitched, I will start simulating the games because I want to give all the pitchers a fair shot of having a video. My first two haven't really gotten to showcase their skills because I can't hit worth crap. Alright, a couple more here and we'll get started. Alright, here we go. And we'll pitch one more for good measure and we'll get this game started. Alright. That looked like it was down the middle. Like always. First pitch up coming here in the All right, here we go. Alex Rios strides forward to get this one underway. The right fielder number 15, Alex Rios. Underway now tonight as the first pitch is looked at. 98, oh my goodness. Let's get this going a little late at 7.06 tonight. EK, you take a look at our home standing nine as they enter ah. play here this evening. They come in in a Freak. real funk to start the year. Still searching for what's been an elusive first win. And that last loss was one of those games oh. you hate to lose it. It really could have gone either way. But Computer says, hi, this usage by the Elgato capture, but I've been doing this forever, and it's not a real big deal. So I don't know why Norton has something up their butt about me recording, but evidently they do. Here comes a one -two. All right, here we go. And a good take there. Close, but it's two and two. 2-2 two, two pitch on the way. Now a little oh, 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 oh. The line Beautiful first, hit. But a foul ball. Wonderful. It it two and two. Freaking excellent. Ready with another 2-2. Two, two. And he's getting his money's worth you up piece there. piece of crap. Full three and two. Waiting next is Austin Jackson. And he gets around on the uh, fastball here as this is well out towards the field. Nice. And he will run this one down, moving to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. Austin Jackson will stand in now following that seven pitch at bat to begin the ball game. If he was smart, he would have gotten a pretty good look all right. at all seven of those pitches from that on deck sir. One strike now from Cole. And oh good job to lay off the fastball there close, but it's one and one. Ready now on one and one. Swing and a miss Ooh. on the fastball, and it's one. That goes two. right by him. One of the things that makes him so tough to hit: the ability to put his pitches right on the black. 
Oh no! It literally does not <clears throat> Dang it! Freaking stupid curveball. I'm pitching it idiotly. A solo shot here Again. straight away right field. Ugh. As the Jays get the game's first tally, it's one to nothing. Justin Turner comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. And look out as this bat shatters on impact. And he'll find a way to dodge the shrapnel out there to make the play for route number two. Carlos Quinton steps in now. Now here's the first pitch. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Yeah, that's a good spot to miss against a guy like this. He loves that pitch up in the zone. Most power hitters do. So that's not a bad idea to give him one above the letters. Started yeah. to go around, but it's ruled strike one, one anyway. Here it comes, two and one. Here's the ball hit pretty well and carrying to deep right. And they all hit it freaking hard. Retire the side. Jay's off to a good start thanks to the solo shot. On to the bottom of the first. It's now one nothing Toronto. D Gordon. We'll step in now to lead things off in the home half of the first. Oh, bull crap. Screw you. TK, you take a look at our visitors as they enter play here this evening. Come in feeling good as they're 2 0 to start the new year. And, and any time you can come into someone else's house and come out of it with a sweep, it really lifts your whole ball club. That's what these guys are looking to do if they can take this third and final game here. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh. And Quentin will Darn this one in for the first out. Rusne Castillo will get his first shot at it here. First pitch coming. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Yeah, and in a good hitter's park like this one, it's going to be even more important than usual to keep that fastball down. That's right where he's got to be living. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Here it comes. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. Here comes the one two. The one two offering looked like a slider that time, but it's two and two. He showed him that slider running away two times in a row. Now might be a good time to call on that two-seamer running in. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. Lined hard to center field. My, uh, darn it. Is there two gone. Come on, Matt Adams. We need something. Now. Two hits for him, including a home run in last night's contest. Now a swing and a oh. ground ball to third. Throw to first. God dang it. Time and side is retired. Man, I can never get a hit. Adam Lind will stand in. He comes off an over four in last night's ball game. Infield in the over shift here. Now the pitch. Swing and a ball hit well to the right side, but this will get into the crowd. Lind awaits the 0 and 1. Hit well down the left field line, but back into the crowd foul. And the pitch. Now a swing and a ground ball, but this will wind up foul. Still 0 and 2. The next 0 2. And he takes nice. three called on the fastball. One gone. All right. Chase Utley will get his first shot here. Two hits in five trips a night ago. Okay, Chase up. Oh. One and Utley awaits the 1-0. -oh. And the 1-0 -oh is sent out to straightaway center field. And two quick outs All here right. in the second. One more quick out plays. Jed Lowry will stand in here, looking to keep the inning alive with two gone now in the top of the second. In there, no balls and a strike. 
And if you're not careful, this is the kind of guy that can run off six scoreless innings against you from here out. So that first inning run isn't something you can bank on holding up. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. All right. And indeed it will. Nice. He throws him out at first, and the side is retired. Evan Gaddis will get his first shot here. A couple of hits in four trips last night. And this is fouled back and out of play. Now the pitch. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. Well, this is a spot where it helps to have a two-seam fastball like that so you can work in on the right-handed hitters. Ah. One pitch is a slider that's cut on and missed for strike two. Now the one-two. And this will be fouled away. Now another one, two. To two balls. Whoo, I got lucky there. Now. Yeah, looked like he hit the target. That's a tough pitch to lay off, but he made it pan out. Here we go. And a bouncing ball, foul. The two, two, one more time. Full count, three and two. Wow, what an at bat he's having right now. He's fought off some tough pitches. He's laid off a few pitches like that one. And now he's worked his way come back. On, come on, come on, come on. He's able to ride this one high and deep toward right center. But that'll be off the wall in right center. Nice. Not in time. And he's in there with a double. <coughs> All right. Guys, if you want to make sure your hitting coach keeps his job for another season, you got to have a few more at-bats like this. I mean, this is exactly what they're preaching to you every day down there in the batting cage. Stay inside the ball. Stay behind the ball. Here he just lets this one travel deep. He gets his arms through, lets the barrel drag a little bit, and then just inside outs this thing right off the right center field wall. Boy, that's strong. In the dirt here. But fortunately here, no advance. Two zero on the way. Fouled back. Ah. Ready with the two one. Now here's a ball hit high and deep out to left center field. Catch made out there in left center as the runner may tag from second. The relay throw and he is in there. Whoo! That was close. That so was a close. So it's RBI spot here. Runner is third, one away. And striding in is the first Malone. pitch. James Loney. Now here's the first pitch. Hit hard. Yes. The middle. And a base hit, and that'll get the run in from third. Whew, at least I tied it up, man. George Springer will stand in with a run in, one out and one on here in the inning. Here's the first offering. Now a hard hit ball. Oh, the no, no. Oh, oh. oh come on, over. man. Well, at least I get the run in anyways. Travis Darno, ready to go here as we begin the third. First pitch coming. Third inning underway oh, now as so the close. ball misses here to start things out. It's 1-0. The 1-0 -oh pitch. Yes. He pops him up over toward foul territory. One away here to begin the third. So the first man set down in the inning now for Gordon Beckham. Designated hitter, Gordon Beckham. And here's the first pitch. And he gets ahead here with the fastball, strike one. You can tell here, in his mind, he's thinking, quick inning. He's not even trying to set guys up. He's coming right after him. On the ground down the first base oh, that's, line. Wow, that and was in. <laughs> take this one to the bag I take it. For the out. Alex Rios will get a second crack at it here. He flied out to lead off the ball game. First offering on the way. And he lays off a pitch here that he probably shouldn't have. 0-1. Real good lateral movement on that two-seam fastball. That pitch is money for him when it's moving like that. 
So just keep on throwing. 0-2 oh, now as a curveball drops in there for a strike. And smart to lay off there as the fastball misses. It's 1-2 and two now. Well, he's had a lot of guys swinging at pitches out of the strike zone early on, so it's a great idea to go ahead and bounce one there on 0-2. Oh Bases are empty here with two men out. Here he comes again. One All right. Two. Strikeout. And he'll oh. lay off the nope. ball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. Yeah, and on one and two, when you know the guy at the plate needs to protect, oh. that's a great spot for that curveball. A lot of guys, they would have gone fishing for that. Full count pitch on its way. And he comes back yes. with a fastball. Strike three called, and the inning is over. Starlin Castro makes his way to the plate to get us started here in the bottom of inning number three. First oh. pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. You know, it's so important with guys like this to get ahead with strike one. Put them behind in the count and on their back foot right away. Come on, come on, come on. Deep right field. Oh. And he's going to have room to put this one away, and that's the first out. One out here in the Yankees' third inning. And that'll bring in Jared Saltolamacchia. And the ball's going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. The pitch. And Saltolamacchia swings right to ah. the He's in the hole now, down 0-2. Now the pitch. Inside as that perhaps will back him off a bit. One and two. And that's the right spot for that slider. Really try hard to tie him up inside. And that's a good job to lay off, too. In tight with the slider, two and two. Now here it comes. And that misses there, so he runs the count full now. So many times, pitchers will get ahead. And they'll start to mess around. And the next thing you know, it's a full count like it is here. Oh, man. D. Gordon will try it again. He flied out to start the home first. And he swings through a ball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. Ah, that thing's knee high on the outside third of the plate. Pretty understandable why come on uh, come on dig door uh, this should end the inning dang it, and indeed it will. oh that was a freaking horrible win is retired Austin Jackson will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth and he waves at a curveball there no balls in a strike well as we've seen so far this isn't a team that's gonna wait around too long to feel a pitcher out they're an aggressive team all the way from top to bottom and if that first pitch is anywhere close, most of these guys are going to take a hack at it. Justin Turner will dig in. He popped out his first time. Good breaking ball there. Had him frozen. Strike one. So tough to hang in there on that pitch. But you got to do it. You can't give up that inside corner, or this guy will eat you alive. Fastball the right. and he turns on it. Hits oh, it that, and oh my God. Field. Castillo. Wow, he freaking wailed that one. Number two. Carlos Quinton will dig in here. He flew out his first time around. Oh, my Here's God. First pitch slider that just tails out of the zone. It's ball one. And if he can get himself into a fastball count, don't be surprised if he has a big cut at something. Maybe try and break. Sorry to All right. Up, but the play Good. has been made for the third out. Inning over. Rusne Castillo will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. And that misses ball one. The next pitch. First two pitches off the mark here. It's 2-0. and And now a pitch on the way. Oh, that that's under this one just a bit as it'll be a chance for Jackson in center. One gone. Oh, no. Matt Adams will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Matt Adams. And it's the outside corner. It's strike one. 
one run, two hits, and no errors for the Yankees so far. Having successful uh. fastball here, it's 0-2 now. And we've seen guys swing at that four-seam riding fastball up in the zone. But you're never going to get on top of that thing when it's up Drop. high. Drop. Oh, you Those piece of crap. As he slides to make the catch. And that's a fine play. Evan Gaddis will stand in. He doubled and later scored his first time. First pitch fastball. Oh, my God. And missed 0-1. And, and he's just running right through these guys. Absolutely worn them down. That's over, but low. It's a ball and a strike. Pitch on the way. And he checks his Screw swing. you and your god dang freaking yes, combination mustache. Screw you. The right hander deals on one and two. Oh, don't know how you lay off that one, but he did, and it's two and two. Yeah, that's a great pitch on one and two. You start it in the zone, and hopefully you'll get that guy thinking Whoa. he needs to protect. Turned out to be a good take. Three and two, here it is. Swing and a miss as the slider sets him down for the, uh. of the inning. Adam Lind will make his way towards the box to lead off the fifth. And a check swing here, but he clearly went around on a pitch that would have been a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. The pitch count there. One pitch into his fifth inning of work. Not much of a concern, I wouldn't imagine. Yeah, it shouldn't be. He hasn't had any real overtaxed innings, so he should be fine for the time being. And a good two-strike pitch, but he misses high one and two. Could be that that high fastball there was just a setup pitch. Now you've kind of established that high sight level. Could be a good time to bring nice. a nasty curveball. And he'll Couple steer bats clear broken already. That freaking heater is freaking kill him. Chase Utley will try it again. He flew out his first time. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. and oh. Here comes the 1-0. Swing and a miss as he ramps up on the fastball, one and one. Oh, he's just cruising out there now. I'll tell you, this may turn into a game of first team to two wins. Pretty well hit. Deep down the line in right, but that's back into the seats. Foul. The one and two with one away. Now a swing and a fly ball. And he pushed it just a bit too much. It'll wind up a foul ball. He'll try again, one, two. And that's high for a ball. It's two and two. Ooh, there's a tough one to take right there on a one and two pitch, especially after fighting off so many pitches leading up to that one. And there we go. Swung on and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the fifth. Jed Lowry will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Jed Lowry. First pitch to him. Come on, first pitch out, please. Swing and a ball hit softly ah. on the ground. But a foul ball here, 0-1. Oh one. one strike now from Cole. And now a pitch that's uh, taken here by Lowry as that evens the count at 1-1. One one. Here's the 1-1. One one. Here's a ground ball to first. Nice, there we go. He'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. 1-2-3 go the Blue Jays. Halfway home, all even at one apiece. Here's the first offering. Swing and a line drive. Ah, right to him. But he'll hardly need to move out there in left as this is hauled in for the first out. James Loney will stand in. An RBI single in his first appearance. And he'll try and crowd him there with a fastball to start the at-bat. It's 1-0. Hmm. He did not like that one bit. You know, it's one thing to work in with the hard stuff, but don't do it around the dome. One one on the way. Now a ball hit pretty well to left, but this is going to wind up in the seats foul. One run, two hits, and no errors for the Yankees so far. Look out! That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. 
Oh, that's not a bad idea right there. Go ahead and try that back foot slider on a one and two. Hope you can get him to commit. That's a good job of laying off of that pitch. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now, three and two. And he misses ball four. George Springer will be the batter. Here's the first pitch to him. And look out, is that one red? Okay, okay, Ross. Freaking hit my freaking brow, son. How dare you? Castro will dig in here. He flew out his first time around. First pitch coming. And a fastball's in there for strike one. Very important here, with two guys on following the hit by pitch, he had to come out and establish the count in his favor, and he did just that. Pause, now the pitch. Oh, oh really come on. Better of him now. It's strike two. A couple of lefties start to get loose now in the bullpen. He's set, now the pitch. A ball and two strikes now to the 2014 All-Star. Maybe a good opportunity here to show him a change up, give him a different look. Here's the one, two. And the slider. Oh, gets come on. Jared Salta Lamacchia. See what he can do here with two on and two out here in inning number five. Now the first pitch. Here we go. Mm, a little tardy there. <sighs> Not a whole lot of conviction in that swing. It was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency hat. He's ready now. The pitch. Here's a fastball that crowds him a bit, and it's one and one. The one one. Now a swing. No. Ball to short, and the two out threat will not come to pass. Dang it! The inning is over. Travis Darno. We'll step in now to lead off the inning as his guys look to maybe break the rut they've been stuck in. Yeah, and after that first inning, it's been all zeros since. And once he kind of got settled into that groove, he's been a difficult nut to crack. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Gordon Beckham will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Too low, 1 0. Not too many strikeouts on the ledger for him so far, but it hasn't really mattered. Yeah, I think ideally you'd like to see him miss a few more bats, but uh, as long as you're keeping guys off balance and you're letting your defense help you, you don't need to strike a ton of guys out to be successful. So a runner at first now with one away, and it's right back to the top of the order for Alex Rios. Curveball looked at here for strike one. And a good pitch there. It's a big front door curveball, and he had no way of opening up to it. And this is going to be a foul ball. He waits. Now the pitch. 0-2 pitch is swung on and lifted nice. in the air out to center field. Under it, Castillo, and Rusny has it for out number two. Austin Jackson will stand in again, but first we'll flash you back to the very first inning of the ball game. And here you go, a solo home run that had him Ooh. off running early on. Well, what happened there? Up and in there with the first pitch fastball, it's ball one. 1-0 one -oh on the way. And he fires in a strike this time to make it one ball and one strike. Yeah, that first fastball took off on him a little bit. This is a much better spot. Swing and a miss, and it's a ball and two strikes here. From the stretch. Now a ball hit what? In the air and deep down the line in left. Oh the my god, thank god. Oh wow. Just does hook oh. oh my god, give me a heart attack. Here's another one, two. And a slide. There we go. On and missed and the side is retired. Whew. Blue Jays held in check. Score remains tied one to one. D. Gordon will try it again. 0 for 2 with a fly out and a ground ball thus far. Swung on and hit in the air. Oh, come on. Left. Right to him. Quentin is there, and these fans won't like that as it's a one pitch out to begin the home half of the sixth. Rusne Castillo will dig in now. He's lined out and flied out in two trips. 
Now a fastball a bit too low here. It's ball one. Here it comes. Lays off again, and it's 2-0. and oh. Both teams with just two hits apiece thus far. Now the 2-0 -oh home. And a swing here on 2-0 and oh as this is in the air. Out went right up. Center. Jackson is in Didn't go anywhere. Now. Come and on. Out number two. Matt Adams will try things again. He's grounded out and lined out in two trips. He'll start him here with a changeup, but it's taken for ball one. Now some definite signs of life in that Toronto bullpen. Both a lefty and a right-hander begin to throw. Here's a swing and there we go. back up the middle. And that's in there, so perhaps some life here with two men out. Evan Gaddis will get another shot. Struck out swinging his last time. He's ready. Now the pitch. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground to second. Throw wow. In time and the side is retired. Ah. Uh. Justin Turner will come forward now to begin the seventh inning in what's been a very briskly played ball game here tonight. That's what happens when you get two starters that are on top of their game. It's been great pitching, great defense, not a lot of base runners, and very even game through six innings. One strike now from Cole. He goes the other way as this is hit in the air toward the gap in right center. Oh, oh come on! What is this garbage? Now, come on, man! What the frick is going on? Oh, what? Oh, my God! What was that? Carlos Quinton will have a oh, my God. Go ahead, run just 90 feet away. Now, the first pitch. Now, the runner's on his way home. Swing and an easy one for the first baseman. But it is not in wow. time. They take the lead here in the late going. Throw to first, not in that time. That was freaking stupid. First pitch coming. Adam Lind is in for the third time now as he takes a called strike. It's 0-1. Yet again, another first pitch strike. And it's a big reason of why he's having the success he is. You establish the count in your favor right away, and it just opens up the door to so many more options going forward. Uh. So one away now in the Toronto 7th, and making his way in is the second baseman, Chase Utley. First pitch on the way. Runner goes for second. Now a swing, and the barrel of the bat breaks in two that time. That ball was so deep in his kitchen, that was the only thing he could do was foul it off, break his bat, and hope to get a better pitch on the next one. Swing and a ball hit on the ground. Uh, this will get foul for strike two. From the belt, kicks and deals. Here's a hard hit ball oh, back come the on. Middle, and that'll just elude his outstretched glove for a base hit. Jed Lowry will stand in again. A couple of ground outs for him on the ledger in his two trips so far. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. And you know, if you're going to challenge a guy up in the zone with a fastball, why not do it on the first pitch? A lot of times, he's going to be taken anyway, and you just bought yourself a strike that you can now throw anything off of. Come set. Now the pitch. He goes the other way. What? Dude! Come on! He waved on home. And this will find the wall out near the visitor's bullpen. And the runner will wow. score in second. And he is in to score as well. Two big in Oh, my God. The lead now to three. Travis Darno will stand in. 0 for 2 thus far. And a bit too high with that one. It's 1 and 0. Oh. Not much success for these guys through the first six, but it appears they found the key to unlock their opponent here in the seventh. Yeah, it's pretty common when you start getting into your third time around against a guy. They've got a much better idea of how to attack him, and now it's starting to pay dividends. And he lays off the breaking ball. <sighs> Two one. Now a ball fouled down the right field line out of play, so that'll move the count to two and two now. 
And some action out in the Yankee bullpen now as a right-hander starts to loosen up. A full count, three balls and two strikes. Seems like whatever was working early on suddenly is not working now. It's almost like he's imploding right before our eyes. Three runs already home here. The three, two, one more time. Out in oh front my ball. god. This is, down the left field line. This is freaking garbage. Here comes Lowry around third. And they'll add one more to the lead. It's now a five to one ball game. Of course. And now they're safe. hitting absolutely everything. Gordon out of Beckham nowhere. Will dig in. One for two. This is retarded. The first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. And this pitch is taken on the inner half for strike one. From the belt, the pitch into center field. What That's the? Get down for a base Come hit. on! He ignores the third base coach and heads for home. And a relay to the plate. And the tag from Salta La Macchia. They got him at the plate. Alex Rio will stand in, and they've done a good job keeping him off base at the top of the lineup. He's 0 for 3 thus far. There's a swing and a ground ball, and a close play at the bag, but a good stretch by the first baseman. Oh, the my the God. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen. Now, here's the first pitch. Manny Machado stands in for the third time now as he takes a look at a ball. It's 1-0. The 1-0. And they're going to have a leadoff base runner here as the fastball's lined into left to base hit. James Loney will stand in. Base on balls his last time. Here's the first offering. And this is on the ground for Lowry and Cooper. Of two. course. A bare hand for one. And now, oh, this ball's going to wind up out of play. And a big mistake there. George Springer will get another shot. Hit by a pitch his last time. First pitch coming. Swing and a miss on a ball in his eyes. One strike. Yeah, he's definitely still bringing it. It's the seventh inning, and we're still here in the catcher's mitt snapping all the way up here. He's set, now the pitch. Oh, and a good tight slider there, and he's in command, nothing in two. Oh, uh, another good pitch there. Uh, I'm not sure he's throwing a bad slider tonight. Every one of them has had a ton of movement. Fastball, strike three called, as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Starlin Castro will stand in now. He flew out in his first time around, and then was a strikeout victim last time. Now, here's the first pitch. Here's the ball hit pretty well and carrying to deep right. And Rios is going to tuck this one away, and the side is retired. The Yanks leave one. They're down here five to one. Austin Jackson will try it again. He homered back in the first inning of this one. Denny Farquhar will be summoned from the bullpen now, as he'll take over to start inning number eight. Austin Jackson. We'll get another crack, one for three thus far. First pitch of the inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's one and oh. One oh. Swung on and missed, one and one. Yeah, I don't think that pitch wound up where he wanted it to, but it did the trick. One one pitch on the way. No offer on that one, two balls and a strike. He's come at him with all off speed stuff so far, but. If I'm at the plate, if I'm hidden, I'm thinking he's going to have to throw a fastball here sooner or later. Sets the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground towards second. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Time to bring you up to date on the numbers for our two starters. It's our starter comparison, and the hometown nine have had trouble generating much by way of hits, as you can see by the left side of your screen. Justin Turner will try again, 0 for 3 thus far. And here's the first pitch. And he lays off a pitch in there for the first strike. A high fastball that time in the strike zone and on the outside corner. But that is a dangerous spot to be pitching if you're only throwing in the low 90s. And 
and that missed it's one and one. Here's the one one. High and wide, two balls and a strike. Pretty clear the plan is to keep everything away. And that's smart for most guys, but Woo! you've got to know your scouting report because this is a guy that can cover the outside part of the play. 2-2. Two, two. And now this ball's lifted in the air down the right field line, but this will get back into the seats, so the count holds at 2-2. Two and two. And this is swung on and missed. Two are quickly retired to start inning number eight. Carlos Quinton will step in. An RBI single this last time around. The cutter runs outside. Ball one. Five one our score as we play the eighth. The one zero. -oh. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. Here's the one one pitch. And he finds a way to catch the zone here. It's one and two. One, two. On oh, a big swing, and he crushes uh. the My goodness, a long home run. So a solo home run for Carlos Quentin. And it's now a six to one ball game. Adam Lind is at the plate now as he looks at strike one. Lind awaits the 0 and 1. In there, strike two. Yeah, a little surprising he didn't offer it that one. That was a dangerous spot for a good fastball hitter. And this is fouled back and out of play. Two out, nobody on. Here's another 0-2. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. Now another 0-2. The next 0 2 misses, and that'll move it to 1 and 2 now. Now here's the pitch. Just inside, not by much. It's 2 and 2. And this is where he gets so tough. He's seen everything he's got, but you've still got to make one more good pitch to get him out. And this ball's hit pretty well. High and deep to straightaway left. Gaddis will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. Jared Saltalamacchia will dig in now. Hitless in his two at bats so far. On the ground to third. And the throw to first is in time, one gun. D. Gordon will stand in for the fourth time now. Still looking for his first hit of the ball game. And he's not the only one either. This has been a great pitching performance so far. They've had these guys chasing their tails all game long. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Two and oh now. And the pitch. Outside. Three and oh now. And this is just a guy that's going to be happy to take a walk. So I'm a little bit surprised that they haven't challenged him a little bit more from the mound. And this is taken here for ball four. Just the second walk he's allowed into his eighth inning of work. Rusne Castillo will step forward now following the walk as he'll hit with a definite speed threat at first and one away. You can bet he's going to see some fastballs in this out now. I'd be looking dead red. First pitch to him. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. A stab and he's got it. Throw and he's called out on a close play at first. Matt Adams will dig in. He singled his last time around. Here's the first offering. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. home. Swing and a miss. Looked like the slider there. A ball and a strike. Now the 1-1. And this is going to be a foul ball. The 
the one two to two balls and two strikes now comes set now the pitch and this misses so that will fill the count at three and two and he does have a base open so he doesn't have to give in on three and two the three two pitch and a slider called strike three as he couldn't pull the trigger and the side is retired. Chase Utley will get us started as they look for a little insurance here in the top of the ninth. And some fireworks perhaps to kick off the ninth as that one just about got him. I don't think he liked that pitch much at all. I don't blame him. That looked a little fishy right there. Fastball at 94 miles an hour and it's one and one. Yeah, there's a good one right there. Right over the top. Just fire that thing in there. Fastball called strike, one and two. Now you can't look for a specific pitch. You just got to protect the plate. Here comes a one-two. Look out. That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. Here comes a two-two. Swing and a hard hit ball to second. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. Jed Lowry. We'll get another crack, one for three thus far. First offering on the way. And a cut fastball in there for a strike. It's 0-1. And you know, this is a guy that loves the ball down and in. It's one of the locations he really covers well, so they're going to want to mix their spots here. Here's a late swing and a miss, strike two. And they'll try to tempt him with a curveball, but this bounces in front of the plate, and it's one and two. That big curveball is not an easy one to take on an 0-2 count. That's a great job of holding on. Check swing, and he went around, says the home plate umpire. No appeal needed, and there are two away. Travis Darno will dig in. He doubled home a run last time around. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Here's the pitch. Well, can't spot the cutter any better than that. Nothing in two now. Now, 0-2 here. This is where you need to expand the zone. If it's close, you got to let it fly. Now a swing and a ground ball. The 0-2 once more. Now a ball lined towards center field. And that's a base hit. Gordon Beckham will stride in. He singled in his last plate appearance. First pitch coming. First pitch here misses wide, 1-0. Oh. Now the 1-0. Oh. Swing, and he takes this the other way to right. And that'll get down for a base hit. Alex Rio will stand in trying to make it three straight two out hits as he's got a runner in scoring position at second with still two away. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Now there's nobody up in the bullpen throwing, so this guy's going to have to sink or swim. Over towards the dugout, but this one will get into the stands. Has a look, now the pitch. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. A big pitch here, one and two. One two pitch is a curveball that misses two and two. Yeah, trying to go front door with that breaking ball started it a little too far inside. Full count now, three and two. Pause, now the pitch. And yeah, there's strike three. So we'll see now if they can manage to hold on to this huge lead as the side is retired. Evan Gaddis will stand in to lead off the inning. Middle third of the lineup, four, five, and six, as they try to get something going. And this whole lineup has been pretty quiet all game long. Just the one run. That's it. 1-0 on the way. And he gets under this one a bit as this is lifted into center field. Jackson is there, and he's got that all-important first out here to start the ninth. Manny Machado will step in. A base hit in his last time. Here's the first pitch to him. 
and he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at bat. It's ball one. Well, one thing we've seen from this guy on the mound so far, when he makes bad pitches, they typically miss out of the strike zone. They don't miss in the zone where they can be crushed. So one one. Drifting over for this one is Rios, but it's back amongst the spectators. Here comes the one two. Now a swing and a bouncing ball toward the hole. And the throw will not be in time, as I don't think he was going to get him anyway, but a fine effort nonetheless. James Loney will stand in. He reached on an error last time through. Now the first pitch. First pitch is a slider called for a strike. And you know, whenever he's been in trouble on the mound, he's found a way to turn things around. And that's a good job to start this guy with strike one. He waits. Now the pitch. And this is hit well towards the hole. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. Here comes a Toronto skipper out toward the pitcher's mound. And he's going to motion for his bullpen here. That'll do it for the starter tonight. George Springer will stand in now. And, hey, give these guys credit. They're not going down without a fight. I'll tell you what, they're not too far away from making a game out of this one after all. He's ready. Now the pitch. That's in there. And he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. Oh, that's a good fastball right there. And you had to figure that he was looking for that sinker. He's set. Now the pitch. And a swing and a miss as they caught him reaching that time, and there are two away. Starlin Castro is the last chance now with two out here in the ninth. First pitch coming. And that's waved at and missed for strike one. Oh, man, what a perfect pitch right there in a perfect spot. And that's exactly how you have to attack a guy like this. He wasn't even close on that pitch. Throw on to first is going to be in time, and the Blue Jays have come in here and finished off a three-game sweep as this one is over. And you know what? I don't care who you're playing. You know, it's never easy to go out on the road and win any game. So that was a great effort by them in every phase of the game. One more look at the final line score there to see the great pitching performance that led his guys to the victory. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, they tried to let him finish off the complete game, but he wound up needing a little help to get the final two outs. Still, eight and a third quality innings take that every time.